welcome you to the George Cow Motor Company Auto Showcase in Newport, Arkansas, the center of the universe. Beautiful, beautiful Monday morning, 75, 80 degrees, nice morning, John G. It has been a scorcher around the Midwest. Boy, I tell you what, yeah, you know, Saturday, uh, me and O'Don Smotherman played golf, and uh, Saturday was really, really hot, and yesterday we got a reprieve, man. We we, we was cool, and the course was beautiful. We had a good time, won a little money, and um, it's going to get hot again this week, but, but that's okay. Every single vehicle we're going to show you today not only has, you know, the, the perpetual windshield wiper deal, air conditioner. No, you're kidding. Every one of them going to have the AC, going to have the cool breeze, and the rock and roll radio. I'll tell you what, you know, these vehicles that you see these days that don't have air conditioners is because they don't work and it costs you a few hundred dollars to get them fixed. That's, that's exactly right. Fixed. Every one of them we got is going to have an AC in it. Hey, I want to say something. I, one of my very dearest friends bought a vehicle last weekend, Mary Hahn. Oh, what a sweetheart of a lady. Just a, a classic Southern lady. And I always enjoy, we spend a lot of time on uh, Thursdays. Me and her and a couple other folks had a little prayer sessions for several years, and we missed doing that. But I just wanted to tell her what a great friend she is, and what a what a lady, and what a joy to be around somebody like that. She she bought a car, but that doesn't have anything to do with our friendship. But I just wanted to say she watches the show every every Saturday morning, and she thinks the jokes are great. I don't know why, but anyway, she does. God bless her, and it's just a joy to have a friend in your life like Mary Hahn. And, you know, you're talking about jokes and stuff, you know. You know you know what frogs drink when it's really, really hot? No. Ice cold croak a cola. Mary, ice cold croak a cola. I want to hear, I don't know. I hear more about the golf game. Tell me about the golf game. Who'd you play with? Uh, me and Don Smotherman, yeah. yeah. We, me and Uncle Don, yeah, we shot 70-66. So we, we played well, had fun, and. Great group out there, and just a lot of fun out there at Newport Country Club. Anybody that's interested in, in a great place to hang around and play golf and just a great group, join the country club. Doesn't cost a whole lot of money, but it sure are a lot of fun people out there. That's exactly <laughs> Excluding right. me, of that's course. A, yeah, yeah. I tell you what, uh, this is the guy. He's number 64 in your program, number one in your heart. We've got to <laughs> rehash just a little bit. Tell me again about the 1968 team. How'd you guys do? We, we, uh, we won them all 10 and 0s. All those years ago, it's still 10 and 0. One never all. changed. It never changed. We scored 301 points, and they scored 51. Five of the teams we played didn't score on us. Still haven't. How'd you do it against the Pioneer at the end of the year? Squeaker. Thanksgiving Day, 68, 46 to nothing. Boys close. Wow. I asked Coach Counts, let me run the ball one time, Coach. I've been a lineman my whole life. He's patted me on the head and said, have a seat, has been. <laughs> True story. <laughs> Have a seat, has been. Yes, sir. Anyway, Finish that, you? hell yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, uh, you mentioned something earlier about looking at the website and yeah. looking at uh, Facebook. Yes. You know, because you post all of these shows on Facebook, so everybody needs to pay attention to that. You know, you can see all these things, and there are specials that we run from time to time. Chelsea and Harmony put specials up on vehicles that that come in. So watch Facebook, you know, the George Kale uh, uh, Facebook like page. Like our page, like you, our page. Wi-Fi page or whatever you call it now. But uh, you can call us here at 870-523-2792 or just well, however you want to do it. It's the way we'll do it. Go on there, George Kale Motors on Facebook. There'll be a little like sign right there. Just press right on that little button right there, and then you will get some of the notifications. You just got to press on it and get some of the notifications of something special that's going on at George Cal Motors. Because we're all the time doing something, and we post it. We do this show once every couple of weeks, yeah. and then sometime in between those couple of weeks, we trade for something else yep. that you might be interested in. So check us out on Facebook or check us out on the website at uh, georgecalmotorcompany.com. Do we have any cars to sell today? Well, we had I had nine lined up, but a friend of mine uh, just came and got one, so we have eight. Well, we'll still talk about that. We'll we're going to talk about it as though it was even sitting here. Yeah. Well, we're going to start with this one, if that's okay. Well, since we're standing here, I think that would be that would be efficient. That would be efficient in the lineup of the program. You're a good man. 2017, yeah, right. 2017 Chevy Suburban, four-wheel drive, heated leather sunroof, double DVDs, one in the second row, one in the third row, power lift gate. Front collision alert, heated steering wheel. Uh, it's got everything on it, four wheel drive. Uh, one owner, clean as a whistle, got the mats in it. Uh, navigation, four wheel drive, 37 8. Really? That's a, lo that's, that's a lot of car, a lot for, of the car money. for the yeah, money. Yeah, that might be the best deal we've got on the line today. 37 8, 
It's got the tan interior, sunroof, double DVDs. Everybody can watch a movie. Unlike when I went to Tracy, California, and a 56 Ford had no air and no radio. I'm not over it yet. <laughs> sunroof, double DVDs, navigation, tan leather, 17 Chevy Silverado. It's got about 80,000 miles, 37.8. I had somebody tell me just the other day, they talked about the, the difference in kids in the last 20, 20 years compared to the kid like us and the heat. And I don't remember as a kid it being hot, but I'm sure that it was. But, but we were out in the yard playing yeah. all the time. And I don't know if you get acclimated to the heat, but uh, I don't remember it being hot as a kid. Do you? I mean, I, well, I mean, yeah, I remember us sweating and running. Yeah, and, you but, know, you get the beads under your neck, you well, know, I the know sweat and the dirt. Yeah, yeah. you're playing kick the can and Red Rover and all that kind of stuff. Then you come home, you had an attic fan. You didn't have no, central heat right. and air. You had an attic fan, which is a pretty cool deal. You know, it pulled out air through the You're screen. Right. You lay right up, in, right up next to that screen. <laughs> Let right me get it close to that screen. That's exactly right. I remember coming home and getting, when we got central heat in there, I thought, boy, we hit the big time now. Yes, sir. I said, you're going to put a window unit in every single room? They said, no, dummy. No. There's going to be one, one big unit that's going to have blow everywhere. So how does that work? They said, we'll cut a hole in the ceiling and they'll have a vent. I didn't believe it, but boy, Learning I sure was happy. Learning process, see? How old were you? Oh, I was in uh, seventh grade. Oh, yeah, well, you learned a little. Seventh grade, I was about uh, 17. <laughs> <laughs> we're moving on to the next automobile. You know, along the way, you think about education, and uh, you, you think about the formal education that you get out of school, but, you know, we get a lot of education outside of the school, like uh, how to learn, how to live, how to eat, how to sleep, how to be a good person, all yeah. that, too. Yes, sir. All of that, yeah. That's real world education. Yes, sir, it is. Yeah, real world education. 19 Ford Edge Titanium. Tells you it's got it all. A lot of safety features. Got navigation, rear camera, sunroof, 50,000 miles on it. 2.0 four cylinder. That's important right now with this gas where it is. Stone gray, black leather interior, a heated leather. It's a great looking car. 33.9 for the 19 Ford Edge. Good looking car, metallic black. No, I tell you, that's not right. I told you, it's stone gray. What? It's stone gray. It looked gray. black because I got these on, but it's called stone gray. There's a difference. Heated and cool seats. Yes, sir. One's kind of gray and the other's kind of black. But it looks black. It looks black to me. Well, it's stone gray, David. Did you not hear me? I heard you say that, okay. but I wasn't quite sure that you it's knew. It's stone gray. Leave it at that. Nice looking car. Edge is a good car. Got a lot of room. It's got kind of a high... Uh, Roof line in, in inside, so it's a, it's a spacious vehicle. They're great cars. We sold a lot of them. 33.9 for the 19 Ford Edge. Good time to talk a little bit about uh, financing because we have uh, the opportunity for you to buy an automobile for us to save you some money. And how do we do that, my friend? How do we get them financed? You can come in here, or you can get online and do your <clears throat> your credit application, and Charlie Steele will go to work for you. Look at the terms, see what they can get you as far as interest rates, length of the contract. Everybody knows interest rates are going up right now. The federal discount rate's been raised, going to be raised some more. Uh, if you got if you got money in the bank, that's a good thing because you get more for your CDs. If you're borrowing money, you need to come on and do it now before it gets any higher. Do the credit app online. We'll see it. We'll get uh, back to you, or you can come do it online, or you can call any of us here, and we'll fill it out on, online. Whatever you want to do is the way we'll do it. Easy way to buy an automobile. Easy way. Easy way to do it. And we'll deliver it to you within a couple of hundred miles. If you don't need to come here, you don't, you don't have the time or whatever, we'll bring the paperwork and the vehicle to you. It's amazing how many people do <coughs> that now, that never come to the dealership and buy a car. Yeah, that's true. And, you know, time is, is of the essence, and everybody's busy, and different things are happening. So if you don't have the opportunity to, to get here and do it, we'll bring the car to you within a couple of hundred miles. So let us know what we can do to make this transition easy, and that's the way we'll do it. We're at George Cow Motor Company in Newport, Arkansas as we move down to the next automobile. We've got a we've got a series of three, three, and three in this next section of three that we're going to is going to be a little bit different than the other two threes of other sets of three that we have, but we'll get there in just a minute. Well, what was that all about? Yeah, I don't know. I just, I don't know. Listen, I'm telling you what, I said a ball game this weekend yesterday. is about 100 degrees. That was nice up here. It's about 97. But anyway. Well, you remember that joke I told the last time Rain. why it got so hot in the baseball stadium after it was over i forgot all the fans left that's they left after it's over what was yeah i remember about? it now yeah i remember it now what is this this is a 19 subaru ascent i traded this uh, out of a young lady and she bought a new at4 acadia this is a 19 subaru ascent 
all-wheel drive, has a sunroof, navigation, 65,000 miles. You know, Subarus are known for their safety Absolutely. and their dependability. Mm -hmm. They're really good vehicles. Got heated seats, navigation, rear camera, already got all-weather mats throughout. Um, it's got second row captain's chairs. Great looking car, priced at 30900 wow. We don't trade for many Subarus. Uh, we don't have a dealer around here. Closest one, I guess, is in Memphis. Right. But they're great vehicles, and they're, they're substantial, and they have a great safety record. So if you're interested in a Subaru Ascent, this is a really, really nice one. One owner, 30900 and it's got a lot of stuff on it. John, talk a little bit about new inventory right now. The, uh, where are we on ordering vehicles? Where are <laughs> we on the inventory itself? I remember us doing a show a year or so ago and said it's going to be a little while before we get it back down to where we can have a bunch of inventory. We still don't have a bunch of inventory, but we've got inventory and we have the ability to order vehicles for you. That's, that's where it's going anymore. And then according to, you know, the people that run these, these dealers, not just the dealership, but run the, the whole nationwide company, the manufacturers, have stated we will probably never see right. lots full of stock vehicles right. anymore. When we used to have 150, 200 brand new right. trucks around here, probably never see that again. Uh, so where it's going to is that you come in and you order your vehicle. We place your order, and uh, when it comes in, we'll call you. We do have some that are coming in right now. We've got some trucks and SUVs that are not spoken for. Right. So continue to watch our website, georgekellmotors.com. You might not see an actual picture. You may see a VIN number and a, a stock photo of a vehicle, uh, and we can tell you more about it when you call us. There you go. We have the most unique vehicle that we're ever going to show you or that we have ever shown you on this show coming right up. One of the cleanest ones that we've ever had on the show. Beautiful automobile here. I don't know if they could tell the color of it on the uh, on the screen, but boy, John, we've got a good one here. Tell us about it. Really this. does, and it does. It has the windshield wiper right here. Got the windshield wipers on your side too. This is a 16 Chevy Impala LS. I sold this car to a friend of mine a number of years ago. It's been under a, a, a under a garage. He traded two vehicles and and for one, it. It is a 2016 Chevy Impala LS. Beautiful it's, car. It's got 44,300 miles on it. It's got the 2.5 four-cylinder. It is as clean as any vehicle I have traded for in a long time. Uh, just had a customer that wanted to look at it, and so they took it with them. But we're telling y'all about it. It's white and it's got tan cloth interior. I want you to look. Look. I want you to look. I want you to look at the tread left on there. Yes, look at the tread. Good looking wheels. Good looking wheels. I was going to guess the color white. <coughs> you took my line. <coughs> We've done this show for a long time. You get all the lines. What color is it? White. That's right. What color is the interior? I don't know. Tan. Tan. I don't ask that. I can't Pay see attention it. when I'm talking. Can't see the interior. 20,900. <laughs> it's as clean as any you'll see. Been kept under an enclosure. Not driven very much. I don't think he drove it. Two or three thousand miles a year yeah. for, since he's had it. When I sold it to him a long time ago, he traded that and a little uh, uh, Chevy Colorado in and got a new vehicle. It's got uh, 2.5 cylinder in it, uh, four cylinder cloth interior. I'm telling, you, I wish you were you, you could see it. Clean as a whistle. Twenty thousand nine hundred. It will probably be sold. Hey, but, you don't get many like this one right here. This is the most unique one that we've ever shown on the show. But I tell you what, oh. oh, watch out now. Oh, dang. You're going to put a dent in both of them. <laughs> wow. That hurt. What color it, is it? It's white with tan interior. Okay. It's yeah. white. How much was it called? How much? 20,900. Really? 44,000 miles on it. Great car. It's a great car. It's as clean. It, it's what we call a cream puff? Well, yeah, I guess you can if you want to, David. Okay, I want to. I want to. Let's go to the next one. Let's do. Uh, let me step around this one. That's pretty cool right there. I like that one. Yeah. I, like I love the how that color doesn't really just doesn't jump back. Yeah, it's demure. Demure? <laughs> or is that manure? <laughs> De, manure, demure. It's all the same, baby. Catherine, Catherine Deneuve. <laughs> you remember on TV? I'm Catherine Deneuve. Yes. Anyway, who cares? <laughs> hey, right here, 18 Buick, Buick Envision, 69,800 miles. Chili. Red. No. It ain't chilly out here. Chilly today, hot tamale. <laughs> chilly red metallic 2.5 four cylinder engine. It's got the light neutral interior in it. It's got uh, and it's it's leather seats, second row heated seats. Got the rear camera, remote start, power lift gate. 69,800 miles on it, priced at 26.9. Goodbye for the Buick. Uh, if you're interested in one of them, then of course you drive them and you like them. them. Great car. We sell a bunch of them. 
26.9 on the 18 Buick Envision. Good looking car. I love the light interior with that with that red color. You know, we had a we had a a, a white car with black interior, and then we got a black car with 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 the tan interior. And I, I guess either way is okay. Obviously, a, a a black interior might get a little warmer. But you know what we have found out? We What'd you found, find out? We found out that if you turn the air conditioner on, like you mentioned earlier in the show, it yeah. cools off in your car. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Get it? Pretty cool. <laughs> and I never thought we could get any worse. Pretty cool. Yeah, turn the air on. Turn the air on and it'll be pretty cool. And I already mentioned every car we got's got air conditioning. Every one, every of, one them. of them. Every one of them. And a rock and roll radio. And they all work. And they all work. Yeah. That's right. I've got, you know, on my, my Yukon, i got to tell this story real quick. I've got oh, half I guess you will. No, listen, i got, my air conditioner works. Half of it works, but the other half doesn't. And it's a little flap that i got to get fixed. I need to get that fixed. It's time. Yeah. I noticed it. So, so what you're saying is your side of the car is cool and Lolly's running hot well, on it. Well, it is, and I better get it fixed in quickly. You're right. You're Boy, right. You better, either that or you let her drive. <laughs> you might be right She ain't putting too. up with that much longer, I guarantee you. Let's move to the next Let's car. Let's do. Let's move to the next car. Holy cow. Now, this one is one of those. And, and, and we love black automobiles. I've driven them all my life. Love yeah. black. A little harder to keep clean. People say, oh, those white ones. No, white is the easiest to keep clean. Black may be the most difficult to keep clean, but the prettiest it's, one when it is clean. That's right. All you got to do is wash it. What's like this shirt? That's right. Pretty. It's hot, though. I guarantee yeah, it's you. it's hot. Yeah. It's yeah. really, really hot. Hey, you know what the pig said when it got really, really hot? I'm bacon. 2020 Chevy Equinox <laughs> LT. <laughs> LT Chevy Equinox, black on black, 48,600 miles. Still got factory warranty, 2.0 turbo. It says 2.0 T on the back back there, turbo. Uh, it's power lift gate, uh, man, it's great engine. Great gas mileage right now. It's got a sunroof, $29,995 on the 2020 Chevy Equinox LT. Good looking car. Black wheels, I don't know if Lolly can see them or not. It's got the blacked out. I think it's got the black bow tie. That's a black edition. So if you want one that looks like a stealth vehicle, you're in luck right here. 2020 Chevy Equinox, $29,995. George Cow Motor Company, we're at the center of the universe. We're in Newport, Arkansas. We sell cars around the world sell them all across the United States. Sometimes we ship them overseas. We just try to take care of our customers regardless of where they are. We do great business and we're very appreciative of our customers, John. Absolutely. Yeah, with that customers, uh, we ain't got much going no, on around not here. not much happening out here, not is Not much. Yeah, that's exactly right. Appreciate everybody. And, you know, everything has changed and, and we do so much business with people that we will never see again. Right. We love it when we sell our local customers because we see them at church, we see them at football games, we see them different things and we get to work with them and take care of their needs when they have something that they need done. But you sell them and you deliver them all over the place. So a lot of, a lot of sales are one-time deals. But we hope they tell their friends and favorite, uh, family too that, hey, I bought a car in Arkansas at George Kale Motors and uh, you know we're in uh, Stockholm, Sweden just over the, the pond there, but uh, they'll take care of you. You mentioned football, Newport Greyhound football coming up less than a couple of months away. Uh, Coach Brian Reardon, who has come back home to Newport, Arkansas from Baseball Southside, he and his wife Julie and a whole new co coaching staff, Josh Austin, is coming back. Josh, a, a, a kid that, that played here at Newport. Uh, uh, Tim Branham, former head football coach here, is coming back to be the offensive coordinator. Brian's assembling a staff. George Kell Motor Company will be the uh, lead sponsor on all of our broadcast. Everything that does with sports, George Kell Motor Company is the lead sponsor. We thank y'all for doing that. But, uh, John, I'm telling you what, I'm looking forward to Greyhound football. It's always fun. I saw Coach Reardon yesterday at the golf tournament. We talked and visited, and I told him how excited I was, and he said, let me tell you something. I got a great, I've got walked into a great team here. Yes, sir. He said, I've got some players. Yes, sir, he does. And I said, well, that's great. And I said, I'm good for about three plays, not all in a row. Maybe one in the first quarter, maybe, you know. I can, we'll run that 53 trap, but not all at one time. Okay? <laughs> but he's excited about it. Community's excited. Won't be long. We'll be firing it up. Boy, I love watching him. I do too. Nothing, nothing like the hounds. I was telling Julie the other day that of anything, you know, I could go to Colorado. I don't want to go to Colorado. I could go anywhere in the fall. I don't want to go. I want to be at Greyhound Field or on the road in the booth supporting the hounds the way I have 
all my life, and you have too, my That's friend. exactly right. Yeah, I moved around a lot of times, but I never forgot about greyhounds. No, I'd, I'd always call and find out Saturday morning who won. That's exactly right. So anyway, get behind the hounds. There's a lot of different opportunities. They've got different uh, business uh, sponsorships, even down to pound pounds or whatever for a hundred bucks you get your name on a sign or you can be something i did something else other than that but but anyway uh there's a lot of ways to support the greyhounds get behind it's gonna be a great year okay we got more cars coming right up all right my friend pickup truck 2000 more class at4 boy that's the hottest thing going right now gmc sierra at4 you can get it all the way through the line you can get it on a terrain an acadia you can get it in truck it, 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 you can get it in a, in a Yukon. AT4 has its own wheels and all that kind of stuff. You know, all the different kind of designs in there. This is a 19 GMC Sierra AT4 Pacific Blue. Got 55,000 miles on it. It's got the 5.3 engine. We're going to show you one over here. It's got the turbo diesel in just a minute. Of course, all of these are heavy loaded. In dash, nav, second row heated seats, hitch guidance, cameras all the way around the dead gum thing, heating cool seats, remote start. Great car, 52.8. Sounds like a lot, but you, you're starting to look at a new one. It's bumping up in the 70s. 52.8 on the 19 GMC with the 5.3 AT4. You know, we talk about this all the time, John. We're a truck country place to do business. We do a lot of trucks. We do a lot of SUVs. It's kind of our bread and butter here. We can get all kinds of, I mean, you know, automobiles if you want to order them, anything in the Buick line. And, mm -hmm. But, you know, even Buick with so many SUVs, it's trucks and SUVs because that's what people want. That's right. It's where we live. It's where, it's where we, where live. we live. With trucks and SUVs mainly. AT4, big boy. I think he's got. I think that must even have a little lift kit on or something, Dave. Because it's, it's kind of it's kind of tall, yeah. standing yeah. tall, looking good. Well, you talking about me standing tall? Yes, sir. That's what I thought. Let's go. Let's go. Now. Here's another AT4. Yeah, tell me about it, Johnny. <laughs> 3.0 diesel. Everybody's loving the D. 25, 26, 27 miles a gallon on a full-size four-wheel drive truck, Cardinal Red. This one's got about 25,000 miles on it. I traded a guy who bought another one. It's a 21. It's it priced at 62.8. Sunroof, heated leather, navigation, trailer tow, load, all the cameras all the way around. Killer O is a 3.0 diesel engine. They're hard to find. Get this guy right here, 62.8. Well, and what we want you to do is come out and drive this thing. We want to show you the power in it. We want to show you how this thing performed because it performs a lot better than what you could ever, ever imagine. And you get the fuel economy also. Even our Buick, it gets a little bit like 30 miles a gallon. You take a big heavy truck like this, you know, they call them the heavy or whatever. Well, yeah. Hey, almost 30. Almost you know, 30 right miles a gallon, yeah. If you good. drive it right, that's right. right. Service with a smile. George Cal Motor Company, taking care of folks. They do. That's, that's one thing. We say it every week. Salesman sells the first one. Service sells the rest. Got the best. The best there is. Good as the best and better than the rest. Accessories in the back. Everything you need, you, whatever you want from, from accessories to doll it up to make it look personal to window tinting. You want to jack it up, you want to put wheels and tires, spray in bed liners, everything you need is right here. And the process of getting your vehicle in the shop starts where and how? You just call in and talk to Justina. She'll set up a schedule for you. When you get here, they'll meet you. They'll come out, they'll spray the vehicle down, they'll put protective covering on the steering wheel and the seats. They're still doing all that because of that COVID deal. They'll take care of you, get you ready to roll. If it ain't rolling, it ain't no good. <laughs> That's exactly yeah. right. Yeah. yeah, it ain't a paperweight. No, sir. Know? So we get you in here, we'll get you in, get you out. That's holding right. something down. Well, we're getting close to the end of this program. We've got several minutes. I bet right a lot of people come. are happy yeah. about that. <laughs> and uh, I, I step, they, the next two or three we're not going to do, correct? The next two no, three. no, the next three, they're not for sale right now. Okay. <clears throat> they well, will be in the next show. Okay. Right here is the 2022 Buick Enclave. This just came in. Now, I pulled it up here, and it will have running boards on it that match the car. But I needed one. I wanted to show one new Buick, and this is called uh, Sage and Whisper Beige. Whisper Beige, Whisper beige Whisper interior. Beige. It's a beautiful vehicle, it man. I tell you, pretty. it's gorgeous. 3.6 V6, got a nine-speed transmission. It'll have the weather mats all the way through it. It's got the premium ride suspension, Sage Metallic Whisper Beige. Uh, the, you can get 3.69% interest for 72 months with approved credit. Uh, it's got a little bit of money, 500 military and first responder and other stuff like that. Priced at 59.830. This would be this would be just like you loaded up Yukon Denali, but it's a Buick Avenir.
Say that, David. Say Avenir. Buick Avenir. Avenir. Sage. Avenir. Whisper Page. Whisper Page. 59830. Beautiful vehicle. Come out and drive it. Buicks are the nicest, quietest rides we have. Come out and drive it. I think it's gorgeous. John, we've got a sales staff that we've had here for some time, and I always look at the dealership, and I look not only at the experience of the sales staff, but also the service department and those people that, that, that work within the organization. I don't know how many hundreds of years worth of experience we have here. Maybe it's something I could look into and maybe come up with a number for Shoot, I've been time. here 100. How long have you been here and talk uh, about your experience? A little over 18 years. 18 years? Yeah, a little over 18 years, yeah. And you got in the car business when? And uh, you were at Ford Company for how long? I was there four years. I've been doing cars 22 years. So I started when I was 12. <laughs> you did indeed, my friend. You did yeah. indeed. Bumping up to 72 years old. Feel pretty good about it feel pretty good about it. Appreciate everybody watching the show and making comments. Well, some of the comments, but appreciate everybody watching and uh, we have a lot of fun and the whole point of this is to sell vehicles. So call us here at George Kale, get on, a, uh, on our web page or call us up. Let uh, Chelsea and Harmony work with you, get you an appointment and we'll take care of you. We'll do everything we can to make you a member of our family. And I tell you what, I'm glad I wore this black shirt. Matter of fact, I was talking to a buddy of mine this weekend he raised his chickens, and I said, is that pretty pretty hard on them right now? He said, well, they're laying omelets. <laughs> well, well, I what hope that, I was hoping and, and we with take, that. No, we're not leaving yet. I want to talk about the side family. I want to, cause, and, and listen, I tell people this all the time, and I mean this from the bottom of my heart, John. I cannot imagine there being a better family of people to work for at any job in the world. Great, great people. Just great people, great friends, great family, and they're, they're good corporate citizens, and they're compassionate. They do a lot of things that go unsung. They don't, they don't do it for a lot of attention, but they do a lot of things around here to help a lot of people. And it's a joy to work for a, com a company and people that, that operate that way. We just ask you to come see us here at George Kell Motors. We're at Tropwin in Sassanacra, right off Highway 67, exit 85, center of the universe. What else? He's John G. Pennington. I'm not. I'm glad. I don't know if he is or not. <laughs> yeah. But like you say, until next time, so long, everybody.